Welcome to this episode of the Hunting Down Adventure YouTube channel. Today, I'm going to be showing you how I build and make this muzzle loader, rifle, percussion cap, tradition, build kit. Let's get to it. So now I'm going to show you how to fire this muzzle loader here. So first things first, I'm going to shoot. It's empty. Where the whole barrel is clean. What you would do is put your cap on and blow it through, but I've already done that. Don't want to use another one. So we're going to take our powder and we're going to put it over our thumb and we're going to shake it down, closing it off. And then we're gonna put it in our measure and then we'll pour it down. Get another 30 grains. Pour it in our measure. Put it down. Or you can just shake it down and pour it straight down the barrel. Okay, so now we're done putting the powder in. What we're next gonna do is I'm gonna move to my other pocket and I got a mini ball or a lead ball and I'm gonna pack it in some wadding and I'll just kind of start it here and take my ball starter and push it down in here and put that on the ground now and then I'll grab my ramrod pack it down in here Give it a shake to make sure the powder gets over here. Is I'll grab a cap and I got my capper here and I will place it on the pin. Put that in my pocket so I don't lose it. Next, I'm gonna put my hearing protection on because now the gun's live. And then I will line it up and when I'm ready, I'll pull it all the way back line it up between the rifle aim and fire now let's go check it out bam right in the bullseye which one was it one right in that bullseye <laughs> bam i hope y'all did enjoy this episode of the hunting down adventure youtube channel i mean this was a great project now, I do have a couple things I do want to say that I'll do differently next time. Um, so, when I blued it, which was really browning it, because that was a, a stuff, I uh, didn't oil it afterwards. Didn't know you needed to. And that was where I really messed up. And so, all this was completely rusted. I'll, uh, if you look back, I'll put up a little image here of where... I was standing it it was rusting which is what it's supposed to do but then it continued to and continued to and so then I had I put some steel wool to it and it now has this really pretty finish and then as for the stock I uh, never sanded it uh, so you can probably hear it this side I didn't sand and then I went back a year later and re-sanded it and now it's nice and smooth. So then I got to thinking um, that we're gonna, I'm going to make this a two-part series. In the next part, I'm going to go over in these little things, showing you how to clean it too, because when you use your caps, that. but what I'll do more importantly and fix the fit and finish of it, where it has that overhang here, I'll sand that down. Down at the trigger guard where it overhangs, fix that. Um, just little details like that. And I'll completely strip the old stain 
which is called true oil, which is like a gun refinisher, not just to stain it. I will redo that. And then, um, and I will go back over it with a walnut stain to darken it to really add to all this. Well, I guess I'll catch you guys on the next episode of the Hunting Down Adventure YouTube channel. Thanks for watching. Tradition build kit. Let's get to it. Then I'll cut and do all the things where I build it. Okay, so now I'm going to show you how to fire this muzzleloader.